Hi there, welcome to WP Expo. Today I will show you how you can create and customize the cart page template for your WooCommerce store, and it will replace the default WooCommerce cart page. For that, I will be using the WooCommerce Builder add-on of Product X. It is the best WooCommerce builder based on Gutenberg, so that you can dynamically redesign all pages of your WooCommerce store without compromising the loading time. So without further ado, let's start creating a custom cart page template. But before going into that, make sure you have the ProductX plugin installed on your site. After properly installing the ProductX plugin, go to the add-on section and make sure that the WooCommerce Builder add-on is turned on. Now go to the Builder section. Here, you can see all available options. For now, let's click on Cart. Here you can see two options. Either, we can start from scratch, or start with any of the available pre-made templates. First of all, I will start with a pre-made template. Later, I will also show the process of starting from scratch. So, please watch the full video for a better understanding. To start using the pre-made template, we need to click on the Import button. Now, as you can see that, the cart template is ready, so you can publish it without making any changes. However, you can also customize it if required. But before going into that, let's see how we can create a cart page template from scratch. For that, click on the Start from Scratch option instead of importing the template. Here you can see that the template is empty. So, we have to fill it up by using the blocks located on the left side. For building a cart page template, Product X offers three blocks which are cart table, cart total, and a free shipping progress bar. We just need to drag and drop the blocks to our desired position. We can also use the Gutenberg column block to achieve our desired look. Then, we need to add any of the product grid or list blocks and sort them using the Query Builder. As we want to display the cross-sell products, we need to select Cross-Sell from the Quick Query drop-down. Now, let's see the available customization options. We can customize all of the blocks individually. To start customizing any of the blocks, just click on it, and you will see the customization options on the right side. For the free shipping progress bar, we can change the text, colors, and typography. Then we can also adjust the border radius and padding. Moreover, we can disable or enable the progress bar. The cart total block has numerous customization options. First of all, we can change the text's choose desired border style and color. We can also play with the customization options for all of the elements of the cart total, including table body, quantity, product image, remove button, and table footer. Similarly, we can also customize the cart total block. After you are done with the customization, just click on the publish button. That's all, our new cart page template is ready. Now let's go to the front end and see how it looks. Here you can see that the old cart page has been replaced with the new one. So that's all from today's video. You can learn more about creating and customizing the WooCommerce cart page template from the blog post. The link will be in the description. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video.